Yo, what's up to all my beautiful friends, subscribers, and folks clicking on this video right now. It's your boy, Adam P, and I'm back with a new video. And if you read the title, then you already know what it is. You shouldn't be clicking on the video if you haven't read the title. It's How to Become a Ninja part one so this is gonna be a series that i'm doing but hey look this video is for my weebs out there like myself geeks nerds you know it, look it doesn't matter whoever you are if you love anime like like i do this video is for you so you're probably wondering adam what qualifies you to teach me how to be a ninja well look stop asking questions but no seriously uh, I feel like I've logged over a million hours watching Naruto, Naruto Shippuden, other anime like Shamurai Shampoo. If I butchered that, that's I don't know. But um, a lot of different anime that have a lot of different fighting styles. But what really stuck out to me is Naruto is one of those series that I used to watch a lot uh, back when I was in middle school and then high school, and then I kind of fell off. And then when Shippuden came back, I jumped back onto it. So I've been binge watching a lot of anime lately. And it came to me, I was like, you know what? Why don't I make something fun for my audience out there? So today we're gonna be focusing on one of the coolest jutsu that they started off, which is the Fireball Jutsu. Man, look, when I was younger, I used to see that boy Sasuke putting them hand signs up so quick, hand signs up so quick, hand signs up so quick, and then shoot a fireball. And I was like, if I was in the Naruto universe and I could learn any jutsu, it always seemed like the fire style one was the coolest one to me, even though now when I've watched it, there seemed like other jutsu that were way more versatile. But look, the fire, we working on the fire style jutsu today, fireball jutsu. So look, the first thing you need in becoming a ninja is a headband. Look, every ninja has it. Look, you can wear it up front, you can wear it to the side, you can wear it over your eye like Akashi, which doesn't work for me. You can wear it over your neck. I might keep it on my neck just because the way this one made it don't look good on my forehead. But as you can see, I got the Leaf Village symbol. And this is the Rogue Ninja one. So this is what uh, Itachi had. Or it could have been the one Sasuke made when he left the village. I'm not 100% sure. But I got this when I went to AWA in uh, Atlanta. Which if you haven't heard of that, it's uh, Anime Weekend Atlanta. I don't know if I already said that. But Anime Weekend Atlanta is a fun convention where people like myself who love anime, love to cosplay, love different things like that, get to gather together. I, I bought a whole bunch of stuff when I was there last year. Unfortunately, I don't think they're gonna have it this year because of you know, the virus and everything. And it's uh, thousands of people that come out for that thing. But on a more positive note, the first thing you're going to need in becoming a ninja is the hair band. Boom, so we got that. The second thing we're gonna do is Watch Naruto, cause we gotta look at different jutsu. We gotta figure out different fire style jutsus. What are the hand signs, you know? Cause you can't, just can't be throwing up crazy stuff like this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw up uh, the hand signs for the fireball jutsu. So we're going to work on learning those different hand signs and then go from there. So when I'm look when I'm looking this up right now, we got horse, tiger, serpent, ram, stop it. Get some help. Monkey, boar, horse and then back to tiger. But well, these a lot of hand signs. Let me see if I can do that a little faster. Pink, 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 
I don't even know, bruh. At the end of Naruto, these people was doing this thing fast. Some of them didn't even use hand signs. I don't know how they did that. But look, so we're going to watch, we watching videos. we learning the hand signs. And where do we go from there? Look, we got to get outside and get us some practice. Because if I do the fire style jutsu in here, well, I don't burn my house up, man. I don't want to burn my posters up. So look, I'm going to catch you guys outside. All right, guys, we are outside right now. I'm gonna try to dodge these ant beds. And you might be wondering, Adam, why do you have a jacket on? Well, for some reason in Alabama, out of all the days, it's been like 70, 80, close to 90 degrees. It decided to be kind of chilly today and kind of windy. So we're outside. Look, we've got the headband on. We've done the research. We looked at the videos. So now, as I'm dodging these ant beds, we're going to put it to practice. So let's do this thing. I'm looking down. I still got to look at the hand sign. So we... Fire style. Fireball jutsu. Oh, your boy. Let's go. Look, look, look. Let, me, let, me, let me try it again. Let me try it again. Fire style. Fireball jutsu. There we go. Oh boy, your boy is a full-fledged ninja. Look, follow them tips. Follow them tricks, man. Look, it was easy, man. Just do the hand signs. And what you want to concentrate on is letting your chakra flow in through your body. You got to focus on the chakra and the wind that's supposedly blowing all over. But you want to focus your chakra in. <sighs> Be peace of mind before you start this. But look. Let me know how you got let, let me know what it worked out with you guys. Look. And also in the comments below, let me know what jutsus you want to see next. You know, we might try some water jutsu, some lightning jutsu. Anything you want to see. Look, let me know. We are under quarantine. So I'm trying to find some fun things. Not only for myself, but for you guys to see. So tell me what you want to see, what you like. Um, how do I normally end this thing? Uh Follow me on Facebook. Just do it! Adam Clayton. Right there. Follow me on Instagram. Just do it! Adam underscore Clayton 93. Bean right there. Follow me on Snapchat. Just do it! Bean a pet 93. Look, follow me. I would greatly appreciate it. I follow back. I'm not one of those people who don't follow. So look. Follow me if you want to see some more fun stuff. Like, subscribe, share. Thank you all for watching. Y'all have a wonderful day. Peace.